Hello, I'm Dr. Jason Horlack. I'm a naturopathic physician with over 20 years clinical experience and a research scientist with a focus on gut health, probiotics, and the microbiome. In this presentation, titled Constipation, Get Your Bowels Moving, we're talking about poo, or more accurately, not pooing, and its myriad negative consequences. We'll start off detailing an easy technique to assess your bowel transit time and learn why it's important to know just how long it takes food to go from mouth to toilet bowl. Over 2,500 years ago, Hippocrates said that poor gastrointestinal function is the root of all disease, and there is a growing body of evidence supporting the role of both gut dysbiosis and gastrointestinal dysfunction, such as slow bowel transit time and constipation, an ever-growing list of diseases. We now know, for example, that being chronically constipated more than doubles your risk of developing Parkinson's disease, and even increases your risk of a range of cardiovascular diseases from stroke to heart failure. And this is in addition to the common symptoms like bloating, distension, abdominal pain, and consequences like hemorrhoids. Constipation is, unfortunately, extremely common in Western nations like the US, Canada, and here in Australia. Thankfully, however, there are a number of things we can do to help manage and often cure this constipation. We'll cover a range of dietary and lifestyle suggestions, as well as highlighting which fiber types work better than others, and which probiotics work better than others to get your bowels moving. And we'll cover which foods are the best constipation medicines, because I love food as medicine when we can do it. And we'll cover what testing to do if your constipation doesn't respond to or even worsens when trialing normal um, dietary and lifestyle measures. And we'll end our discussion on constipation with natural approaches to intestinal methanogen overgrowth, a common driver of non-responsive slow transit time and constipation. And we'll discuss some potentially novel approaches to this, again, common condition. The good news is constipation can be effectively treated and in many cases cured. If you suffer from slow bowels or constipation, it is vital for your overall health to get your bowels moving. So join me in learning how.